much. Way too much. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. If you're new to the channel, we do cars. So behind me is my 2001 Nissan S15, which we bought as a bit of a fixer up sort of project. For the last couple of months, we've been making videos on this, fixing up all the things that have been wrong with it, because it was pretty neglected, pretty average when we got it. It's got some 18 inch wheels. It's got this nice red intercooled logo that seems to really grind some people's gears. I'm looking at you, mate. So it's staying at the moment because I really like bugging people. We put a resonator on the exhaust because it was a bit loud and droney. It's like a three inch straight through exhaust. Fully serviced the car, mostly fully serviced. Uh, we bled the brakes last video. We replaced the tail lights because they were aftermarket jobbies. We didn't like them. The car's running a Haltech ECU and a mathless tune. So we've just got a dirty big green pod filter uh, on there, a big HKS super suction. So it makes a heap of dosy spoolie boy noises, but none of that really makes you go fast at the racetrack. So we'll see how we do. All the stuff we've done up until this point has been able to get the car to a safe point where we can get it on the racetrack. And I wanted to get it to the track before I really started diving into the mods on the car so that we have, uh, I guess, a rough benchmark or a time so that hopefully when we do some modifications to the car, we can see an improvement and see the car actually get faster. So I just wanted to give it something tangible, something quantifiable, rather than just putting on some coilovers and some grippier tires and telling you guys that, that the car feels like it handles a lot better. So today is the exciting day where we're actually going to Lakeside International Raceway, I believe it's called. We're gonna try and set a fastest time there that we can with my average skills and this average old girl. So come along with us, uh, it's gonna be a good day. Let's do it. Let's do it, mm, do it, mm. Whoa! Whoa! Maybe we'll be like the samurai on the track. Righto, so we've made it here to Lakeside. As you can see, lovely looking track in the background. Looks like a good lineup of cars here. Everyone looks a bit more serious than myself. <laughs> Thanks, Dad, for coming out here with me. Hey, today, I'm, 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 I'm pleased to be here. So there is heaps of people here, it is really busy. Just making me a bit nervous and a lot of really fast looking cars, really serious cars. So I sort of feel out of place, which is interesting. I thought this would be a fairly quiet midweek, you know, everyone's supposed to be at work, but obviously people with race cars are not working or take the day off. So it's gonna be good. There's a heap of variety here, but I'm hoping we'll just be in the slow group. We can see what is what with the S15. I think it's gonna be a great day. Driver's briefing in 10 minutes at the driver's briefing. So what do you call in this? A sighting lap, I think. Okay. It's the fast version of a pit wall. And what sort of a car are we actually following? Uh, I think it's a Porsche 911. Wow. It's my sort of speed. Where do I be here? I don't even know. It's so wide. Whichever that one. <laughs> A bit nervous. Nervous? <laughs> yeah. This is okay. Don't forget your helmet. Yeah, I, I did forget it, did you see? <laughs>
That's good. It's a bit warm in here with the windows up. This car is really good though, like the car's not leaving me wanting at all. G'day. Hello. <laughs> Temps are good. Yeah, the car seems to be running really well. There's a slight little vibration, uh, really high RPM, not sure what that is. But apart from that, I mean an open diff. <laughs> tires really is this, even the suspension feels pretty good so a lot of driver mods that need doing I've got a lot to learn on this track and in general so yeah that's my thoughts so far I went down to the slower group because I felt slow in the faster group. So I'm now in the slowest group. Felt pretty good. More comfortable that time, I guess, going faster. The car's going pretty good. Nothing really report. I don't know how fast that one was. Take the Mustang. Take it. So we made it home and it was a successful day. It was a heap of fun. Uh, the S15 performed awesome. So we had no brake fade at all, just a little bit of smoke. They were smoking after the first run. It had some sort of vibration at like high RPM. I don't know if that's drive shaft or... Tires did okay. Not as bad as I thought actually, which is a shame because that's one less excuse I've got. Every session we improved in lap time. So that was really, really good to see. I think pushing a little bit harder, getting more comfortable with the car taking it longer into corners, using the brakes more. Righto, so we got the times here. We did four sessions, and in the first session, I did a 114. You just trust me. I did a 114.6, which is pretty slow. And then we improved. The next session we did a 112.1. 
Then the next session was a 111.3. And the last session of the day, we managed a 110.2. So four seconds roughly uh, over the course of the day by learning the track. Everything went quite well. I'm really happy with the S15 chassis. There was such a good variety of cars there. Some great people there that I got to chat with and hopefully get we'll catch up with in the future. It's all in all uh, a great day. A really good day. Anyway, guys, I'm absolutely knackered. Now it's time to go. That's going to be it for this video today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button if you like this video. Get subscribed so you can stay up to date and follow this car on its journey. Because from here, we're hoping to go faster and maybe more sideways. Drop a comment down below and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.